guys, welcome back. We are Love and Junk. I'm Laura. I'm John. And this is another viewer box from one of you. Yeah. Uh, we are so excited. So John went ahead and cut the top because, I mean, if you've seen our channel, sometimes we have a struggle, struggle bus <laughs> a little bit with that. Uh, there's a lot of tape, you know, because it's coming from uh, a faraway land. So we appreciate that. So he went ahead and cut it open. Uh, we have not seen what's inside. Uh, this is exciting. These are some of our absolute favorite videos to film. Yeah. We love that you think enough of us to send us things that you want to see us try. Um, you send us the sweetest messages always. We get letters and emails and messages on uh, social media that yeah. just warms our heart so very much so and we are so grateful yeah you never have to send us anything but when you do it means so very much i mean up till this year we have completely funded our channel um financially and you know we kind of felt emotionally <laughs> is there anybody out there Hello. <laughs> just kidding just kidding um some of you have been here for a minute some of you have been here since the beginning and we thank you all for yeah. your love and support your kind words and comments it all means so much so absolutely let's see who this is from what's on your shirt oh nobody knows there's a card all right, look at that card. Isn't that pretty? That's some yeah. of our favorite things too. Yeah, I love it. Um, Cause sometimes when you're sending things from another country, even your your cards, your postcards, all of that kind of, your stationery, all of that sometimes is different from what we have too. So yeah. I always find that interesting. Your packaging or whatever. Dear John and Laura, some Scottish treats to try. Yay! From Bonnie Scotland, love Shirley. Nice. Yay. That's awesome. Thanks, Shirley. Yes, yeah, thank you, Shirley. That's so sweet. Let's see All what right, we get so... to try. Here, I'll get them out. Okay. <gasps> oh, oh, oh. Whoa. Woo! Man, these things are heavy. Oh, fudge. What? <gasps> oh. Oh my gosh. Okay, so if you, I guess they want to be let in on what we're eating or not. No. <laughs> so I have salted caramel dipped fudge. Nice. Yum. I should probably say brands if I can read it. I think, oh, Buckman's. Mm. Buchanan's or? Hold on. Yeah. The person <laughs> who needs to have glasses on should not be doing the reading. <laughs> the fine taste of Scotland. These are from the same brand, Iron Iron Brew Humbugs. Did we you can't even talk. Wait, did you really just say Iron? <laughs> iron. Oh boy. But okay, for real, what are they? I got I got hooked on what you're saying for Iron me. Iron Brew Humbugs. Boiled ah. sweets with chewy center bursting with iron brew flavor. Mm. I don't know what that means, what but we're gonna find doing? out. Okay. Mm Lee's Mint Chocolate. Thank you. Yeah, that's definitely a Laura thing right there, isn't it? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay. I see a little moo cow on here. Mackey's of Scotland. I can read that, but I can't. Honeycomb. honeycomb. <gasps> Dairy milk okay. chocolate with honeycomb pieces. That's going to be incredible. I can tell. And what's this? Melt in the mouth. Baked by hand, Dean's original family recipes, light and crumbly shortbread fingers. This is definitely my sort of thing. No way! Oh yeah, I've claimed it. We both love shortbread. Now, by we both, she means me. Okay, all right, again, you should be doing the reading. Okay. Uh, Mrs. Tilly's original Scottish fudge. Mrs. It doesn't say what flavor or anything? It's just fudge? Original. Oh, original. Okay. I don't know. Original Scottish fudge is what it says. Miss Tilly's again, the famous Scottish tablet. What does that mean? I don't know, but we're going to try it. And again, another Mrs. Tilly's original Scottish macaroon. Mm. Macaroon. Nice. And you're good. All right, where are we going first? 
Oh boy. I think mint last for yeah. sure yeah, and yeah. shortbread first. Woohoo! Don't you think? Because everything oh, I, also kind of I think. coat our palette. What the packaging on this? I can't tell you what this is. I mean, it's mint chocolate, I understand, but I don't know if it's a bar or what. It feels like it has texture, which yeah. I mean, yay, I'm excited. I love shortbread. Me too. I've got my coffee right here ready to go. Look at that. What a cool little container. A little tray. Yeah, it looks so flaky. Wow. Guess what's going to be all over my black shirt? <laughs> crumbs. There you go. Oh my gosh. I am excited about this. Uh-huh. Cheers. Cheers. I love how thick it is. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mmm, guess what? We bought tea. Now we're going to be trying some different ones coming up soon. But this is coffee. Yeah, we did buy tea. This yeah. Is not tea. I'm just letting it know. Yeah. <laughs> but what I'm saying is we bought some tea. Mm -hmm. And maybe we could freeze these and put them back because I feel like that's the perfect kind of thing to go with oh tea. And then gosh. we can try them in our tea video. Yeah, we should. It is. I love that you get that salt in there too. Oh, man, it's mm -hmm. good. Oh, Woo! those are yummy. Who's this <laughs> brand? Deans. Deans. Good job. Deans. Got it going on. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's see if I can get this back in here. Um, mm -hmm. There we go. We're close. Maybe not. I give up. Okay. We'll do it later. Mm -hmm. All right. Fudge? Fudge. Mm -hmm. Macaroon? Tablet? Do you think? I think you should read ingredients just to be on okay. the safe side sugar whole milk no Salt. i don't mean allowed <laughs> <laughs> i mean check for nuts if you knew i have a nut allergy so just checking nope we're good here we go Ooh. which one is this original this is tablet what does tablet mean? I have no idea. We'll have to. I'm afraid. And the yep. reason I had them look is the color of it looks like peanut butter fudge, kind of. I can't tell from smelling it. I can't either. Kind of seems But I like, feel like it's going to melt away. Yeah. For and sure. Kind of seems like what? Like, I don't know. Is, but that's good. Oh my oh, gosh. Wow. It does just melt. You can taste the butter in that. Mm -hmm. It is almost like, sorry, if you know what tablet is <laughs> and you're screaming at us, it's this, it's this. <laughs> sorry, we don't know. Um, and we could look things up, but you know, we want to experience things in real time with you guys. So if you never had this before, it tastes like the kind of thing that somebody's grandma makes for the holidays and it's just mm -hmm. super rich that you just want a little bit of at a time you can taste the butter it's more towards the caramel side yes. of flavors than it is of that. like chocolate or like butterscotch but it's not that exactly yeah it's almost it's almost like a caramel or a butterscotch, but like, like it wasn't uh, like cooked all the way to make it into a caramel or a butterscotch, and then solidified into a tablet. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, that's it's good. good. It's, it's delicious. I love it. You can taste like the real ingredients in it. Yeah. Uh, that fell out. I'll have to eat it. 
This one just says fudge. Fudge. You check. The bold ingredient, or the, yeah, the bolded. Yes, bold milk. That's the only one. Okay. So this is original Scottish fudge. I'm not allergic to milk, but the day's still young. <laughs> <laughs> you never know what's going to happen. So I'm anxious to see the difference because the color is very similar to the one that says tablet. Oops, there you go. Thank you. But it's darker. Yeah. And it smells like butterscotch. It does. Cheers. Cheers. I tell you what, I am not normally a fudge person. It is not. I mean, it's it's okay, but in really, really small amounts because it's just so rich and a lot of times the, I don't know, it's just not my thing. These are delicious. Mm -hmm. This Mrs. Tilly's, Mrs. Tilly's got it going on. These are good. I love fudge. Well, that's really good. Wow. Let us know, too, um, if you're watching, and know, is this the kind of thing that you see in a grocery store, or do you have to go to a candy shop to get it? Because yeah. I can tell you here, um, you don't walk into a grocery store and find fudge. You have to get fudge from a candy shop, you can get fudge from like a gift shop. Yeah, some specialty that, store. Yeah. You, you know, if you go to, if you go on vacation um, and there's a touristy spot that has like t-shirts and whatever, sometimes you'll see fudge there. Yeah. Um, but you don't find it at grocery stores. So I'm, no. I'm so curious. I mean, maybe in some places maybe, but. Um, I'll tell you what. That's. Amazing. These bars are a salad. I'll check that one too, please. Yeah, I already checked this one. Okay. What's the crunchy stuff, I wonder? Uh, coconut, right? Oh. It's a macaroon. I assume That brings macaroon. up the whole... Yeah, coconut. Macaroon, macaron. <laughs> <laughs> macaroon, macaron. Ooh. We had oh. macarons when we went to New Orleans. Yeah. And I did not have a... Reaction. I mean, I know there's almond flour in them. I didn't have a reaction, so it gives me hope that maybe I'm on the mend. Yeah, <laughs> maybe I'm. I developed my allergy. We think later in life, so maybe I'm gonna get over it. Here you, you know go. Like, oh. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Did you smell it? It looks like you know. It's got the outside there, but inside the, um, the coconut. Did you smell it? Yeah, yeah, buddy. This is the kind of thing I yeah, love. Yeah, boy. I love coconut. <laughs> mm hmm. All of these things are definitely going on my side over here. They are not. Oh. <laughs> uh. mm. Are these three fudges? Oh, we got more fudges to try. Yeah. Do you want to rank all the fudge together so we can try this fudge as well? I mean, we can do whatever we want. I say we talk about favorites of these and then we'll maybe do the whole thing. Okay. What's your favorite out of these? These are really, okay. Sorry if this is, I don't mean this to be like, not insulting is the word, ignorant, I guess. I want to know the difference between the two. It feels like this is derived from this or this is derived from this it's just like cooked longer like you said right. like the caramel the difference between butterscotch and caramel is the amount of sugar or butter it's like the same ingredients but the um the amounts are different <laughs> words are hard words are hard sometimes. um but they feel like they have similar ingredients in them yeah right? yeah similar flavor tell. profiles and everything yeah um you know what both of those would be good with? Nuts. Which, of course, I can't have, but I can see that. <laughs> yeah. Mm. I don't know. I believe they're perfect the way they are. My goodness. No, but I'm great. saying, like, I bet they make them with nuts and other things in them, too. Mm -hmm. um, I love the texture of this one. Yeah. I don't know which one's my favorite. I kind of think the original fudge is my favorite. 
I think the tablet is my favorite. Really? They're yeah. both, they're similar. Yeah, I mean, they're all delicious. My word. Yeah, I can't pick a favorite. I like them all. But if I had to pick one, probably fudge. If I were to say, this one's mine, that one's yours, I would say, me fudge, you tablet. Me fudge, you me tablet. Me Tarzan, you Jane. <laughs> okay. Hey. <laughs> me um, Tarzan, you monkey. How about this? Uh, Honeycomb. Mackey's of Scotland. Honeycomb dairy milk chocolate with honeycomb pieces. Looky, looky. Uh-oh. They got the same peel. If I can work it. Work it. Oh, my word. Well, you fight with that. I'm going to say <laughs> hello and welcome if you're new or welcome back if you're not. Hello. It's a busy weekend of filming. It's a busy weekend of trying to open things. Over at Love and Junk Studios, oh, a.k.a. Boy. our game room. Still working on our redecorating projects and... Resealable, but you can't get a edge on it to open it. What else can I entertain you with? <laughs> Me trying to open things? Aha! I got a grip, finally. It reminds me, you know those documentaries where they give a monkey, like, a piano? <laughs> <laughs> or a computer, and they seem to be able to figure out how to use it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. There you go. Yep. Oh, wait, I want to smell it. Okay. Smells yummy. Cheers. Mmm. Mm-hmm. That is super smooth chocolate. Again, it does not surprise me. That's good. Mmm. I just got honeycomb little yeah. crunchies. Yum. I love it. You know, um, what was it, a crunchy bar, I think, we've, yeah. we've had before that had the big honeycomb on I chocolate? Mm-hmm. We don't have that sort of thing in the States, and mm-hmm. it makes me sad. I'm so happy that we get these things. Now, you know, to try on our channel, because honeycomb, that's great. Mm-hmm. Wow. <sighs> that's delicious. Anyways, all right. Crumbs. Somebody needs to vacuum. How about this? Here, read that part. All right. Buchanan's of Scotland began producing their range of fine confectionery in 1856 and have been delighting customers ever since. Mm. Hmm. Known as the Confectionery Clan, it is one of Britain's most famous confectionery brands making toffees, fudges, hard boiled sweets. Chews, chocolates, gums, and jellies. There you go. So the difference between a gum and a jelly would be a gum would be like a gummy yeah. candy that we get, yeah. and a jelly is like a like, like a, a what's it called? I can't think like of the, the word. Like the consistency of the gum jelly drop. babies, or like yeah, a gum drop. drop. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I mean, I love them all. Mm-hmm. I feel like I'm actually covered in shortbread crumbs. <laughs> yeah, now the shortbread crumbs. <laughs> Let's go wrap. Oh, I like it. Yeah. Ooh, that looks Nice good. outfit. Ooh. Nice outfit. Salted caramel dipped fudge. These fancy. look really good. They look fancy. Fancy. Look how pretty they are, too. Ooh, on the top. Oh, I guess wow. we could have shared, huh? <gasps> They're super soft, if you're wondering. Ah, yeah. They're good. like, look. Ooh, stretchy. Cheers. Cheers. Oh my goodness. I love that texture. Mmm. Whoa. You're making it so hard for us. How am I supposed to pick what my favorite is in the box when I can't tell? Wow. That caramel is so, like, rich. 
buttery and soft and chewy. You know what? Woo! At Christmas time, we talked about making homemade caramels. You know, the kind that you wrap up in little bits of wax paper because we've never done that. We wanted to do it on our channel and somehow time got away, you know, trying to make videos, trying to shop, trying to, you know, do everything. But we should, that makes me think, I want to try to make, because there, there is nothing that you can walk into a store and buy um, here that is that rich. I mean, in a specialty store, yes. Yeah, right. That tastes, I mean, it comes in a package like this that you think that you would get just at your grocery store, and maybe you did, but it tastes super, super high-end. Yeah. Um, wow. <laughs> that is just delicious. These better hide. <laughs> They're going to hide in my belly. Let's see. <laughs> I'm so curious. Um... Yes. Sugar, glucose syrup, dark. It is dark chocolate. Mm. And that's what it tastes like, too. Yum. So good. So good. You want to try a humbug? Yeah. Iron blue, blue humbug. It's like the first day we ever tried talking. Yeah. <laughs> we're, we're struggling with the speaking. Here's yours. Wow. Thanks. Look at the size of those things. Yeah. Those are the last stuff. Good while. Good what is there a flavor? Oh yeah, whatever you said Humbug. about it. You said iron. <laughs> iron. Iron brew. Yes, iron brew. Cheers. Mmm. Woo. <laughs> Those are good. Mmm. I like how you guys call them boiled sweets. We just call them hard candies. I love, um, I've seen things like this before, and I don't know how to convey my feelings, but how there's like a creamy layer and a not creamy layer. Mm -hmm. I love when hard candy or boiled sweets does that. It's like two different textures, kind of. Not textures, but you know what I mean. Like there's a creaminess, and then there's like a more sharp flavor. Yeah. These big candies make me nervous though like a choking hazard or something i'm like oh mm -hmm. but man they're delicious mm -hmm. but let's see yep chewy center haven't gotten there yet mm -mm. Mm -mm. I'm not doing that. These are so good. I don't know what to tell you about the flavor. Kind of it's, tastes a little orangey, but. Yeah, it's, there's orange, but it's almost like orange mixed with something. Yeah, I don't know what this flavor is either. Look at the ingredients. Glucose syrup, sugar, citric acid, palm oil, color, paprika mm. extract, mm. flavoring. That's it. And now it's all stuck in my teeth. <laughs> I'm going to save that for later because otherwise we're going to be doing that for a long time. It's either stuck in my teeth or those are my teeth. about the flavor they are definitely citrusy orangey tangerine yeah <laughs> they're good <laughs> those are good that's why you don't chew hard candy mm. now i'm excited for this <laughs> what reading the back of it <laughs> what's so funny just making sure nope i mean I'm, i don't know that i've seen Mint and nuts together often, but you just never know. 
Wow. Yeah. You never know. Look. Wow, Laura's doing that. Uh, hello, and what? I mean, what? Oh. I can't do your spiel. This is Lee's. I already did it. Oh. I'm pretty oh. sure. Oh, I'm pretty sure. Well, hello and welcome. Oh my if you're new, gosh. You're welcome back. Delicious smelling. I could like feel it in the back of my throat when I smelled it. <laughs> this like, sort of thing makes you happy, doesn't it? Yes. It's <laughs> super dark chocolate and oh. Let's go. Mm. That's definitely something that mm. you love. That's good. Oh, oh my that. gosh. I want to chop that up and put it in ice cream. That'd be mm. good. The mint is really, really good. It's super strong, but, which yeah. I don't. Um, I mean that in a good way. It's really strong. It makes me really thirsty. Um, yeah, the dark chocolate is delicious on it. Yeah. Too. Yummy. I love too that it comes. We don't have anything packaged like this. We have no. York, York peppermint patties and whatever. Yeah. So if Junior you're curious, Vince. there's three products <coughs> like this that come in a package. Ooh, that's amazing. Um, all right. Wow. Surely. This is amazing. You picked amazing things for us. And I love, you know, we can tell. Sometimes you want us to try things that you love. And sometimes you include things that you know that we've mentioned that we love. We love all of that stuff, no matter what you send. It's, it's appreciated greatly. And... You know that I love mint, and you know that we both love shortbread, and you know that John really loves, you know, dark chocolate. And whenever we open shortbread. these, you know, whenever we open these boxes, we're always like, oh, that's for you, or that's for me. <laughs> we really loved everything in this whole box, and we cannot wait. I'm glad that we're, we waited to do this on the weekend, so now we can eat it yeah. all up <laughs> tonight. Scottish treats are absolutely amazing. Yeah. Wow. All right, so time to rank. Rank your favorites. Mm. You want to go first or second? Uh, first. Okay. Okay. Um, these things right here fall like at the top of my list, I think. Okay. Which was amazing because I didn't think that was going to be possible. I really did not think that these were going to be these Mrs. Tilly's. Mm -hmm. I, I really didn't think that. Because this looks more like artisanal and yeah, what I, and the, you know this looks you know manufactured and whatever. Yeah, yeah. right. I cannot believe the quality of <laughs> those. They're delicious. This is so hard because also we got the shortbread. I know. I there's nothing in here that I didn't like or, you know, sometimes we say we really like this one and these not so much. There's nothing in here that I didn't love. I, I don't, I really don't think that I can rank these. I'll rank them. Because. For me. Yeah. You have to. Well, do you want to see mine? Yeah, you do it. You go. You go, girl. A lot of times when it comes, what it comes down to for me is what we can, either what I'm going to crave or miss or really wish we could get here that we can't. Or what's really, yeah, what's really different. Mm -hmm. um, these two are really tugging at me. Really? Uh, but we can get something similar-ish. So for me, this was number one. I, I think that is for me too. Is that crazy? Salted caramel dipped fudge. It's just so different. And when we think of fudge, we definitely think of this kind of thing. Yeah. Not... Not these little kind of things. The uh, amazing. That's my number one. Yeah, those. Um, my number two. Um, is the regular fudge. 
I just have to do this because yeah. I mean, this video is going to be an hour long and 30 minutes of it is going to be <laughs> me going, hmm, but I really like this and I don't want to hurt the shortbread's feelings, you know, or whatever. <laughs> like, <laughs> uh, yeah. I just have to do it. Um, that fudge, all of, then I'm going to say. Poor shortbread. Tablet, then I'm going to say that. The fudges first, then shortbread. But it, here's the thing. It depends on what I'm in the mood for. I don't always want chocolate or like really, I like little bits of things. I don't want always want something that's really sweet. So if I were in the mood for, you know, something that wasn't sweet. Yeah, you have to kind of balance it. Stuff, yeah. You know? I mean, this is a completely different thing than that. Yes. You know? Oh, yes, indeed. Um... Oh, this is this is tough. Um, then the mint, just because mint, is, you know, in my heart. But we can get something similar here, but it's it's not that quality. But right. it is one of my favorite things. Then the, I don't. These two are tough. I loved how smooth this chocolate was, and I love the honeycomb. Yeah, me too. But this isn't best to worst. This is. Probably the order in which things are going to get eaten. Maybe. I, I don't know. And then I'm going to save this last for me only because it's harder to eat. You know, I'm, I'm going to go back to it. I love the flavor the of flavor it. The flavor is great. Um, but it's just, you know, we don't. It's hard to like eat and talk while we're doing this. So yeah. I'm going to enjoy that later. <laughs> um, but I, I loved it too. Yeah. And I love the name, Humbugs. Humbugs. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to rank the, the only way that this works is if we rank the fudges, then look the, like you did smart. So I'm going to rank the fudges. I do think that this is my number one as well. I am going to move the tablet to number two. It's very, very close. Very close. All of these are close. Um, as far as the shortbread in the box, this is my favorite right here. <laughs> yeah. Who was this? Dean's. That's right. Yeah. Um, for the bars, I'm going to move the honeycomb up. And I could have done that too. It's like, am yeah. I in the mood for mint or am I in the mood for... Yeah. Because if you're craving chocolate, for me, if I'm craving chocolate, I don't go mint. For when I, when I have something like this, right. even though I know there's chocolate in it, when I eat something like this, I'm craving the mint, not yeah. the chocolate. Yeah. So anyway, but I, so I could have easily switched them. Yeah. You made it really difficult for us. It's And these then are these all here. Delicious. Yep. I loved this flavor. I wish somebody could give me words to describe what that flavor is. It's definitely in the orange family. It seemed like it, didn't it? It's almost like orange and orange cream mixed together. Like, mm -hmm. it's not super puckery orange or strong orange. It's just nice and light. It's, yeah. Once John said choking hazard, then that made me nervous. <laughs> and that's all I could think about. Anyway, we had a good laugh at that. Yeah. <laughs> so, Shirley, thank you. This was so amazing and sweet. You never have to send us anything, but we so appreciate when you do. Great, and great, Bob. Our tummies appreciate it. We appreciate it because then we're able to make extra content for you guys. And yeah. um, it's so fun for us to see. Like I said, what I, I so appreciate the packaging is different than what we have and even what you call things and yeah. brand names and all of that is so different and right. we love to see it all so sure do. thank you thank you thank you from the bottom of our heart if you are not subscribed to our channel please do so now is that Indeed. like the second third or 15th time we said that in this yeah, video? Who knows? Like i don't know if we mentioned it before but it never hurts to ask for you to subscribe. Make sure you hit the little bell beep, so you can be notified when our new videos do go up. Um, come find us on social media. We have our links in our channel banner, which is the place where all of our pictures are on the main page. We have our Pinterest, Facebook, Facebook, Twitter. Instagram, and Twitter all linked. Um, now, if you love treats from faraway places or Scotland, what? Yes. Or Shirley, our friend. Yeah. Or us or the video. Give this video a big thumbs up. That's all we have for today. We will see you tomorrow. That's it, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.